celebration in the sport. We welcome you to Chipotle Basketball Nationals, presented by the Army National Guard. And here just west of Indianapolis, it's time to answer the question, who is the best high school basketball team in the country? Montford Academy from Florida, undefeated and chasing its seventh national championship, played all year long to be undefeated. Harris driving against his future college teammate, and Isaiah Abraham splashes in the three. Her, her shoulders, which can't be. Queen the lob, Newell headed to Georgia with an and one. Beautiful execution by Injury. Cooper Flag comes up with the steal. And Flag hits the pull up. Yesterday. Wide open, Flag buries the three. Now, part of the big lineup for Montverde is their best defensively with this lineup. Gone for the big man. He answers with a triple. He'll be Flag's team. Behind the arc, and he is a load inside. Him and Derek Queen is a great matchup. McNeely is a marksman. Wing it up. Scoring game. The talent on the court is undeniable. Harris wants a three. Give it to him. Back and forth we go. Montverde likes to screen it on top. And Wright hits the floater. The future good for both teams. Oh, they're playing on adrenaline right now. There is no tomorrow. Harris over Flag. Right down the shoot. Over Cooper Flag. Flag. Rattles it home. Again, Cooper Flag. Has that same mindset so far today. Gonba on the switch. Flag slipped. Got it to Newell. And Curtis Gibbons, money from the outside. Flag for Harris and Gonba. Big first quarters for PVI. This is one of the best number one classes that Duke has had in a while. And Harris opens this. LSU. Queen, a freight train. He lays it home. Gogba attacks the closeout for Queen, and he floats it in. How about the... Uh, at the top of the key, a little shot fake. Looks like a flick. Like re-enters your picture. Abraham, the pull-up. Tough. That's good. And Cooper Flag took a... Under 10 to shoot. Haven't said that often today. McNeely off balance. He throws it in off glass. Sundra, stretch big, doing his part. It's a three. Lost the handle. Gone by the steal. Ahead to Jordan Smith for the deuce. Great move by Jordan Smith. Flag against Gongba. And Gibbons rattles in his third three of the half. Hammond banks it in. Montford certainly won it into the hands of Gibbons. Flag. And Queen with the putback slam. Hammett gives it up. Smith the wraparound, and Gongba lays it home. That was defending Queen now. Gibbons getting downhill, and he floats it in. Now he has become that X factor for Montford. They're running the same play for him again. Given stays hot. His fourth. This is why Chipotle Nationals is the best. Queen against Gongba. Now flag. Rising up. On target. A three at the end of the half for the number one player in the country. That shot does not count at the. The superpower of Cooper Flag. Queen the lob. Newell to the top floor. Get into the middle. Derek Queen catches turns. Asa Newell, a great lob catcher. He's got great bounce. His ability absolutely had a case to be a McDonald's All American, but the limit is three per school. As Sundra knocks down the three. Get the focus on the team and on his game. Gibbons got past Gongba. Nice ball movement. And Wright floats it in. We in Houston that he's always trying to stay in the moment. Just be present where he is. Smith puts it in for Paul the sixth. And he's just a one seed a year ago. 
just seated in the lane after missing the tip in at the buzzer as Queen scores for Montford. Mouth from last year, and he does not forget what happened and how it happened. Smith, the offensive rebound, off the flyby. Harris connects. It's a three. Plenty Hurley is uh, saying it, well, he's got to fuel up for his freshman year. Givens got another one. Thanks for what he gives this team. Doesn't have to be the star, but tonight he is. Hammond with the floater for Paul the sixth. The Rangers won the World Series last year. Harris for three. No. Oh, oh Abraham. It got doesn't it. look pretty, but it counts. It's that guac, man. Flag the kick. Givens, one more. Give it to him. Curtis Givens has gone nuclear. Abraham blocked on the perimeter by Flag. He's got another one. And Flags fly forever. The number one player in the nation closing out the third quarter with a bang. The Sports Center top 10. The block. The push, the determination, and the flush. It's all Cooper Flag and Montford at Chipotle Nationals. Great pass. Now Kongba with a flush by Paul the Sixth. Right navigates it, and he flips it home. Guards win games. For our player this season from Montverde. They had all the other pieces. Queen, no. Oh, look how flag soars about everyone trying to follow. Derek Queen, your majesty, put back and one. Of Gongbo, you saw it on the bench. Playing so well this week, coming back from the injury. Harris scoops it in with a foul. Ball to his teammate. New sneakers in the locker room for Cooper Flag waiting. Three to shoot here. Uh, McNeely trying to find Flag. And oh. he banks it in at the shot clock buzzer. Sir, Cooper Flag cooking again. Abraham with a three. DVI needs turnovers and quickly. That's not going to help. Queen at the rack. Great assist by Allen. Let's give a lot of credit to Kevin Boyle Jr., who in the last month took Derek Queen for extra workouts at nighttime. Not basketball workouts, but conditioning workouts. Just to get him real that you're in the best shape possible. Yeah, you have to do everything you can to put yourself in a position to win. You can't leave anything to chance. Junior Adlon Elamine with the pure stroke and a timeout. When it comes to passing the basketball, now, who do you compare him to? I have no idea. He's got the versatility of a LeBron James. He's got the toughness of a Jimmy Butler. And a lot of people say Kevin Garnett type. I can see that as well. But he's his own man, Kevin uh, Cooper Flag. And Monford senses it now with 45 seconds. As Flag exits with the rest of the starters. 16 in the quarterfinals. Came out assertive in the semis against Columbus with 28. And the all-around game today that is typical for him. You don't see him smile very often. Seventh for Montford in 11 years. As Ann Brown, the sophomore, hits from deep for Paul the Sixth. So the final seconds come off the clock. It is number seven for Montford. And luck has nothing to do with it. The Montford Eagles are Chipotle High School National Champions for the seventh time in 11 years. In the opening game against AZ Compass Prep, they were down at the half, a little bit rusty. Off for 30 days, they came out smoking in the second half. They beat Columbus. And so do Cooper Flag and the Montford Eagles. 79-63 over Paul the Sixth. The hardware 
heading back home to Central Florida. Well, you can hear Cooper Flagg's competitiveness in that interview with Lindsey. Great job, Lindsey. Cooper Flagg tests opponents and the dump button. He brings the edge <laughs> even to the interview. Stick it on the bracket. Montford wins the national title in high school basketball. For Paul Biancardi, Lindsey Polaris, and our entire crew, Ted Emmerich saying so long from Brownsburg. On to Cleveland, the NCAA Women's Basketball Championship open practice.